All right, welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Jay, aka the Burner Whistle. As you can see, my co pilot is here with me. I don't even have to tell y'all what we're watching today. Y'all already know. It's the last day of Halloween, and it's time for the main event. As y'all can see, he's already know I'm stressed out. He's been trying to make me feel better for the last 30 minutes while I've been sitting here. And it's not helping. Oh, I should say hi to all the new people. Hey, new people. Because I know a lot of y'all here for this. The exorcist in the movie, I never wanted to watch. I never had curiosity about nothing. Not never. This is one of the movies that, and some of y'all probably think this is childish. I don't even care. But when I was younger, and my mom used to take me to the video um, rental place, if I'm walking down the aisle, if I seen the exorcist video case, I wouldn't even walk down the aisle. Like, I would stop where I'm at and go back the other way. Like, I, there's part of the store I never walked by because of that movie. I just want to let you know, it's early in the morning, too. Early. Because I'm not watching this at nighttime. Hell, this might not end up being as scary as I made it out to be in my head. I I, I think it's going to be way worse. But I'm not taking a chance of watching this at night. Y'all can't see him on camera, but I just want to let you know, right off the screen, I have a Bible and a prayer cloth. I didn't say a prayer. I done meditated. And you see, he's, he's trying to still make me feel better because I don't feel good about this movie. I don't want to watch it. I don't. I'm not even going to lie to y'all, Blake. I'm excited to watch it. I'm not. I want no part of this movie. I'm telling you, go... Go back and look at last month. Look at my beard. And look at my beard now. Y'all done this. Y'all the ones that laughing right now? Did this. Joe Wade has stressed me out. Before we get into this, I need y'all to do me a favor. I need y'all hit that like and subscribe for me down there. Also, don't forget that bell notification. Also, down in the description is a link to the Patreon. Over to the Patreon. You'll find all my full-length YouTube reactions. You'll find exclusive movies and exclusive TV shows over there. You also get access to our weekly polls. People vote on what I watch on Fridays. So, speaking of Patreon, I like to thank our VIP members. I like to thank Leslie Trey, John Harrell, Becca Jones, their beautiful dog Missy, Brandon, Big Al, Robin, John DePatrick, Simon X, Lost Opportunity. Cody Stoudemire, Frost1997, Paul Sawicki, Grady B. Olsen, Donnie Boy, Adam, Anna Rondo, Big Frank, JB, Echo, Nyring. I know I've been saying that wrong. I'm going to get it right. I can't, I got to remember how to say it. I, I tried to, I practiced it earlier. And I, I'm stressed out. <laughs> sorry. I have it right next time. I promise. I promise. I promise. I'm sorry. TJ Gingler, Kevin Riley, Red Hill Z, Thomas E. Johnson Jr., and Steve McClusa. I want to thank y'all being VIP members. I want to thank everybody else for being um part of the family as well. Y'all make everything worth it. Even this hell y'all been putting me through this month. It's it's been worth it. I tell you what, after this month, I don't, I don't think I want to watch that scary for a little bit. <laughs> I'm telling y'all, hey, stress. Like it's Sunday. It's a very well good. It's a, it's a very good chance that I'm I'll get done watching this and go straight to a church somewhere. I'm been doing this intro for what twenty minutes. Stressed out. Halloween is brought to you by this month's sponsor. Even I used to have a regular office chair to do my reactions in, but within a week, that chair broke on me. I tried to continue to use that office chair, but it was extremely uncomfortable, and I never knew from minute to minute how stable it was going to be. I don't have those problems anymore because of Ewan. Ewan has premier award-winning gaming chairs and gaming desks. They have heavy-duty chairs that hold up to 550 pounds with 4D armrests and pew leather. For myself, 
I opted for the E Win Championship Series Aeronomic with Cold Cure Foam and Pillows. The Cold Cure Foam rivals memory foam with its durability and softness. E Win has adjustable 4D armrests. E Win offers an adjustable tilt with lock function. That way you can lean back in your seat and have more comfort. For me, doing movie reactions and being a heavy gamer, E Win came in clutch with an amazing chair that provides top level comfort. That's why over 2 million users choose Ewin. So head on over to eracing.com so you get your gaming chair and a gaming desk. Don't forget to use the code EOL so you get your 20% discount. I don't think I got enough lights on. He already asleep. I'm going to tell you. If this movie get too stressful, I'm waking his little ass up. He gonna come over here and sit with me. I can't lie to y'all and tell y'all I'm looking forward to watching this. So I'm just gonna say it's time. <laughs> See you on the other side. Let's get it. What an excellent day for an exorcism. I don't like this chat in my ear already. I don't care what it is. Don't like it. I'm telling you, I can't work out in the sun like that. I will go crazy. Like, you know how hot it is over there? I will lose my mind. Like, I will start stabbing people with that. First person to say something stupid. I told y'all before, I will just turn to the Incredible Hulk. I'm like, Jay, what's wrong? It's hot. So listen, look. This movie just starting, but they dig it for the shit to find something. And the movie's called The Exorcist. So this is why you don't need to find everything. Some just need to be left buried. <laughs> Other man shaking like that. <laughs> Shut up. I guess he didn't hear that loud ass horse coming. Oh, I thought this movie's about to change real quick. Just don't feel like we should be right there. Like I feel like Georgetown where I know this ain't Georgetown, Kentucky. I cut this off right now. Look, lady, I don't know what that is, but that don't sound normal. I'm telling y'all, I don't, I never want to add it. Never want one. Never. If I move in a place and I got to add it, what's ever up there is up there. I'll never discover it. It could be $5 million up there in a briefcase. I will never know. But I'm not going up there. Oh, Carl, we've got rats in the attic. You better get some traps. Them is not rats. I think it's clean. All right, then we've got clean rats. No rats. I just heard them, Carl. Them is grown men rats. They up there playing poker and having conversations. <laughs> rats. Warner Bros. C39, hotel, take four. 
So the movie inside a movie. Hey, you know what else is creepy and scary movies? Nuns. What you do today? Yeah. Mm -hmm. What's that? And uh, me and Chum played a game in the backyard. You did. And we. So far, this movie is nothing like I expected. Father, I'm a Catholic. Shut up! I know I jump. Shut up! I died he fell. That's why I jump. Shut up. Where the f is he going? This place looks worse than where Rocky lives. This movie's already stressing me out. At least way too calm up front. Mama? Mama. Your uncle John passed by to visit me. Oh, really? When? That's a mama thing. I don't care when you show up to your mama's place, they, she gonna cook. Hey, where'd this come from? I found it. It's time to move out. No, we're moving out tonight. Right now, pack your Yep. You know how? I'll show you. Y'all think the bullshit. I broke up with a girl with one of them. You need to. No, you don't. Oh, yeah. Well, let's both put that. It's time to go. Captain Howdy said no. Who? Captain Howdy. Who's Captain Howdy? I make the questions and he does the answers. Oh. Oh, we're not talking to him. They ain't there. They got a name. No, we're not. No. Captain Howdy, do you think my mom's pretty? Oh, no, we're not doing none of this. Captain Howdy, that isn't very nice. Well, maybe sleeping. Oh, I just don't, I'm just, I'm, I'm disturbed by that. Like, for real, like, I broke up over a chick, with, with a chick over there. I, actually, I broke up with two chicks over there. I remember one drew one on the back of a, uh, top of a shoebox and made one. It had a bottle cap. I ain't spoke to that bitch since. Mm-mm. That scared me a little bit. I came out. I could see about a transfer, Damien. I need reassignment, Tom. I want out of this job. It's wrong. It's... Is the name Damien? That's what they said. I need out. I'm unfit. I think I've lost my faith, Tom. Hello? Yes, this is Mrs. McNeil. Christ, can you believe this? He doesn't even call his daughter on her birthday. Why does music change up like this? No, operator, I've given you the number four times. No, don't tell me to be calm, goddammit! Oh, she's a cur. What are you doing here? My bed was shaking. I can't get to sleep. So her bed's shaking. There's a Ouija board in the house. And we got an angry ice machine upstairs. Time to move out. No, we're not doing that. We're not. No, we're not. Especially at nighttime, we're not doing that. What are you doing? Can we cut lights on? Oh, that's that's the problem for another day. Hasn't even got real in this movie yet. This movie's already been over. I've been in it. I'm just telling you, I don't like. I'm not going through this. I'm not doing that. Smells <laughs> nasty. Oh. Yeah, but you see, no rats. No rats. That's terrific. Fuck that. Did you see your flame? Your flame did a blowtorch thing. We're moving. For all the people that's new here. As you can see, I am not a hero. I'm not going to be the one to discover shit. I'm not going to be the one to rescue you. I'm not. 
You put yourself in that position, that is God's will. What the f I don't even know what to say about that. They gave her Madonna titties and a dick. He'll breathe normally. Can you feel this? I don't feel anything. When the red light goes on, that's your temperature. I don't want it. Oh, this little bitch is... Mm. Mm. Hey, go throw some holy water on her. Mm. Oh, she's on that. Oh, wait. A disorder of the nerves. Hyperactivity. Temper. Now this is for Ritalin. Now y'all need to put that little girl on Jesus. That's what y'all need to put her on. That Ritalin ain't strong enough. Nobody knows the cause of hyperkinetic behavior in a child. Oh, I think we should wait and see what happens with the Ritalin. And she keeps a cigarette handy, don't she? Are you a relative? Yes, I am her brother. He is her son. Just a minute. Damn. Did you see her glasses? find Mrs. Harrison the last bit on the left hand side. Hey man, she can see people's thoughts from glasses. There seems to be an alien pubic hair in my gym. Have you? He's had pubic hair. We're not gonna be that calm about that. And like he was gonna go plug it out like he's in his drinking it. Oh, right. He's soft stuff. My man is sauced up. They're allowed as Alright. I think we got a guest. We're gonna die up there. Oh, this bitch is pissing the floor. I ain't shit wrong with it. I'm sorry she's been sick. She okay. didn't know what she was saying. Okay. I got Romulus house broken. So is Grogu. Why, why ain't she? Mother, what's wrong with me? You, you be talking to, um, what was his name? It's just like the doctor said, it's nerves, and that's all. No, it's, it's, it's your little buddy you was talking to asking questions. What's his name? Hootie, Howdy Doody, what's his name? Y'all know who I'm talking about. The Ouija board dude. And the mother the teeth that you had a vision about in the at the doctor's office. Why ain't we gone? Grab your daughter, let's go. This bitch gonna try to hold the bed down. Listen, if they're in this house tomorrow in this movie. This woman's stupid. We would have took what we got on our backs and been gone. I should have been there. I wasn't there. I should have been there. There was nothing you could do. Yeah. Well, you know, steal my shoes now. I tell fortunes by reading the creases. Now shut up and go to sleep. You tell him to go to sleep, he still got a cigarette in his hand. Okay. And then how far has to get started? The puppy. Mm -hmm. I don't like that little flash where the f that is. I don't want it! You fucking bastard! Oh, you nasty bitch! And you need your ass whipped on sight type of disturbance in the chemical electrical activity of the brain. It's rare, but it does cause bizarre hallucinations, usually just before a convulsion. The whole bed was thumping and rising off the floor and shaking. Mrs. McNeil, the problem with your daughter is not her bed. It's her brain. Now, dog, you're not going to sit here and talk to me like I'm crazy. I know what the f I say. Talk to the maid. She heard the s***. I think it's uh, 
last for days or even weeks. And I can't get over these motherfuckers smoking in the hospital. Now, Reagan, you're going to feel something a little bit cold and wet. Oh, uh, You're going to feel a little stick here. Don't move. Oh, no. Hey. He handled that like a chip. Oh, my God, what are y'all doing to this little girl? Oh, God. Is that necessary? Do they still do that? What is that? I don't never want that. Oh, God. That might have been the hardest I've had to watch this one. Thank God for technology. Oh, my God. Did you give her the medication I gave you? Yes. What was that? They call those spasms. There's something Dr. Please help her. Oh, that's not normal. Keep away. The sow is mine. Fuck me. Fuck me. Did she slap herself like that? Listen, never anywhere ever have I ever seen somebody grab their pussy and shake it at somebody and say, fuck me. And the fact that it came from a 12-year-old girl is more disturbing than anything ever. I know somebody's in her body right now. But still, it doesn't change the fact that I seen a little twelve year old girl do that. Like, that is horrible. You've heard the story. Same thing here. Same principle. I mean, not uh, that's not how that works. We still think the temporal lobe. What are you talking about, for Christ's sakes? Fucking out of her mind, psychotic, like a what you, a split personality. The personality? Did you not see? Now I know the. Temptation to leap to psychiatry, but any reasonable psychiatrist would exhaust the somatic possibilities first. This can be my kid. I whoop their ass. I'm going to tell you. Did you not see this motherfucker getting ragged all by themselves? They doing this shit. Dr. Tanny says the x rays are negative. In other words, normal. You keep any drugs in your house? No. Yes, a Ouija board. I just, I just feel like all this has been afforded. If we'd have moved out, when we found the Ouija board, I don't care how extreme y'all think that shit is. Don't care. Out of left. Been gone. Sure. Listen, you're you're not this stupid. You need to get about. Did, was, was that the teeth thing again? I went to Lord Hurt Room by myself. I wouldn't even touch her. I would treat her like she got cooties. And I know y'all saying that's her daughter. It ain't mine. Haven't heard. Haven't heard. Burke's dead. He must have been drunk. He fell down from the top of the steps right outside. Broke his neck. Oh, God. Shut the f up. She didn't kill Bert. Oh, hold on, I gotta pee. I gotta pee. I gotta pee. Listen. I just had to go pee. I'm telling you now, right now. I understand you staying because it's your daughter. And I'm telling this to any of my friends. If this ever happened to one of your kids and I'm there, you ain't got to ever worry about me coming back over. Ever. Who is it? Don't even call my phone. Text me.
Is it Captain Howdy? Well, I'm not being around for that. Do you see that shit coming out of my mouth, too? I'm speaking to the person inside of Reagan now. You two are hypnotized. Just answer all my questions. Can you hypnotize me? And answer me now. <coughs> Look, that little girl that sounds like DMX. We're not we're not staying in the room with this. Who are you? Oh, fuck all this. Look, lady, you're, you're on your own. I understand you got some troubles. I wish I could help you, but I ain't with this. I just, I just don't feel like this little girl can have a normal life after this. It looks like a type of disorder that's uh, rarely ever seen anymore, except in primitive cultures. Frankly, we really don't know much about it at all. She needs some chapstick. I am not going to lock her up in some goddamn asylum. And I don't care what you call it, I'm not putting her away. Jesus Christ, 88 doctors, and all you can tell me with all of your bullshit is... I mean, it's your fault. You let the little girl play with a Ouija board. You was going, you was going to play with the Ouija board with her. When she tells you, hey, I've been talking to, what is his name? Actually, I don't even give a what his name is. It don't matter. You ever heard of exorcism? Stylized ritual in which the uh, rabbi or the priest try to drive out the so-called invading spirit. You're telling me that I should take my daughter to a witch doctor? Well, the regular doctors ain't working. I mean, we did watch it. How did they do that? Yeah, yeah, speaking of that. All right, so... How she run out of themselves like that? Because when was this movie made? 73? They ain't had special effects like that. How she run out of them steps? How they do that? I, hey, she wouldn't have made it all the way down the steps. I'd have burnt that whole house down. Like I said, not my daughter. Carl, did you put this in Reagan's bedroom? Carl, if you put this in Reagan's bedroom, I want you to tell me. Now, did you? Yes, bitch, your daughter's crazy. She's possessed. She's more mad that the cross is under her daughter's pillow than anything else that happened in this movie. Actually, I take it back. She's more mad about the cross than she is about the Ouija board. I mean, I gotta pause this for a second. Oh no, I gotta, I just got. I wish I could, I wish you understood everything I'm saying to you right now. Have you ever just watched something and never in your life you ever thought you would see something like that? I, I would talk to the camera, but this, I paused it. it. It can't go to Patreon. He might put it on YouTube. I don't know if I didn't pause the recording, but never. In my life, have I ever imagined, thought, 
I, I I never thought I would see somebody, especially a a little 12, 13 year old, 14 year old girl, stab themselves in their pussy with a cross and say, and then watch their head spin around. Like, I feel like I need to go shower right now. And I got an hour left in this movie. I'm so disturbed by this shit right now. Like I want, I want to go get ice cream right now and just come back and just sit here. Cause I'm pretty sure blanks want to add this to the YouTube version. Y'all on Patreon, y'all probably have never seen this till YouTube. This... Huh? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I'm Father Karras. Jeffrey Dahmer just walked by. You're a friend of Father Dyer's, right? Yes, I am. Did he talk to you about my party? Well, about my daughter? No, I didn't know you had one. He didn't mention her? No. Adam mentioned it. Miss McNeil, since the day I joined the Jesuits, I've never met one priest who has performed an exorcism. Yeah, well... Well, she needs one. It just so happens that somebody very close to me is, is probably possessed. I don't. I think we're way past probably. You know what I'm saying? I just feel like Jesus Christ wants somebody. No, you help don't me. see. You don't understand. Oh, can't you help her? Just tell him. Listen, I was talking to this little bitch, and her head spun around. Well, I was talking to whoever took over this little bitch. I don't know what we calling her. Him. Talking to DMX, and he was himself with a cross. Like, listen to this shit. Hello, Reagan. What the f that is not a Reagan. I'm Damien Carras. And I'm the devil. Now kindly undo these straps. Where's Reagan? In here with us. With us? Your mother's in here with his cars. Would you like to leave a message? I see that she gets it. Shut the f up. And you must know my mother's maiden name. What is it? Hello! <laughs> oh, f y'all for that. Oh. Shut up. I'll kiss my ass. Oh my god. Thank you. Uh I don't want them back burning them. Uh I need evidence that the church would accept his signs of possession. Well you do Bruh, she just threw up on you from across the room. With accuracy, bruh. That's not normal. Oh my god. Did Reagan know a priest was coming over? Did you know my mother died recently? Is Reagan aware of it? Not at all. Why'd you ask? It's not important. Good night. Bro, everything about this situation is important. This is the cup of my blood. The blood of the new and everlasting covenant. The... What an excellent day for an exorcism. But wouldn't that drive you out of Reagan? My this movie, man. Did you do that? Uh, I bet they didn't clean their off her. What's that? Holy water. You keep it away. Uh, uh, it burns! Uh, <laughs> nobody move it! Please! I'm not sitting next to it! Oh, uh, look at your, your fucking shirt! I would come in there with a bucket of holy water and just be like, ah, ah, bitch, yeah. Want a drink? Please. Ice, water. Okay. Make me a graveyard. I want one of everything. Put it in the same cup. We didn't listen to serious. Shit. I sprinkled it on her and she reacted very violently. It's tap water. Huh? English. 
That's English in reverse. Give us time. Flattered. Also, she talking backwards. Also, she a red rum mother. Shut up. I'll be right there. Well, what's wrong, what is it? Shh. Man, they're not gonna tell us what's going on? Why are we still here? We're, the service, why are we here? Listen, I can I can go work at McDonald's. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna be a servant at a place where they got a demonic little girl upstairs. You're convinced that it's genuine? No, not really. I suppose. What do you mean you don't know? What about the Exorcist? How about Lancaster Marin? Who? I had notion he was over in Iraq. Oh, you talking about that dude? crazy. Like I just, I just, I just, I just, I just. That's a creepy shot right there. Look at this one with the eyes, man. Oh, Mrs. McNeil. Yes. You can't see his face. I know he is, but you can't see his face. It's an honor to meet you, Father. Would you like some brandy in that, Father? Well, the doctors say I shouldn't, but thank God, my will is weak. And they just be drinking, don't they? Especially important is the warning to avoid conversations with him. He's a liar, but he will also mix lies with the truth to attack us. Oh, so he's a regular person. I know people that do that on a daily. I'm not comfortable at all right now. I haven't been comfortable in a long time, but I just, I'm just really not comfortable right now. She sounds like a damn dinosaur from Grass Park. Stick your cock up her ass, you motherfucking cocksucker. Be silent. Oh. Oh. Why does this demon want this little girl to get so bad? Got a little R. Kelly in them. Oh, oh, you nasty bitch! Thy kingdom come, thy will be done. Oh, get it off your face! Give us this day. Oh, God! Your mother sucks cocks and hell, oh, Lord, Paris, you prayer. faithless oh, slime. The disrespect. Lord, hear my prayer. Oh, hell no. The bed is floating. To confront this cruel demon. Why do y'all like this disturbing shit? See the cross of the Lord. Oh, uh! Lord, hear my prayer. Let my cry come unto thee. Oh my God, it's so fing nasty. Look at it, though, that's a good thing. I wouldn't touch it. I would not touch it. <laughs> Why is it laughing? Why is it laughing? <laughs> I cast you out! <laughs> it In the name of the Father, by this sign of the Holy Cross, Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns. Look at this shit, man! Damien! <laughs> Look down in pity. You killed your mother. Your Shut up. I'll never give you. Return, oh Lord. Shut up. The devil's price commands you to depart from the servant of God. It's the power. The power of Christ compels you. The power of Christ compels you. Be compelled. The power of Christ compels you. The power of Christ compels you. Do not despise my command because you know me to be a sinner. I couldn't touch you. I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. <laughs> the blood of the martyrs commands you. <laughs> oh! 
let's rest before we start again. Before we start again? Oh, we not done? I'm not sitting on the edge of the bed with that. And you're not leaving me alone in here with that. I'm so f***ed up by this movie, man. I can't even play this movie. I'm not going back in there. What is this old oh, man taking? He took that earlier. Oh, hell no. Dime, why you do this to me? You're not my mother. Dime, please. What is it? What is it? Her heart. It's a polycuras menos. You're not my mother! Don't listen. I know you're weak. I'm soft. I mean, just for the sake of argument, what happens if we just put a shotgun to our forehead and pull the trigger? Just do it leave then? I'm just asking. And like I said earlier, once again, this is not my daughter. I'm just asking. If everything else failed, would that work? I mean, you might not want to put that in hand reach to her. She used those kind of different. Is it over? No. Why he show up? Oh, he did. Hey, why she sitting there posed up like that? Like she's sexy or some <laughs> So did the little girl win? You son of a bitch! <laughs> Come into me! Take me! Take me! So that's what happened to old dude. Somebody found me. Somebody help. Oh, there's no help. He's dead. You don't walk that off. <laughs> oh, did it work? Did it, did it... Do you want to make a confession? How many bodies are there? Shut the f up. Where do you want this? What is it? We're not taking nothing out this house. We're burning everything. That's everything. I'm going to miss you. Oh, we're not going to miss you. No. You or your daughter. Not miss another that shit. I need hazard pay. Right. I'll call you. Why is she looking at his neck like that? Was she looking at the little white thing? I thought you'd like to keep this. Why don't you keep it? Is everything just sweet now? So, I mean, uh, uh huh? Lieutenant? How's the girl? She seemed fine. You go to films? I got passes. In fact, I got a pass to the crest. I've seen it. Another one. Had your lunch? No. So that last little music they played right there, when they was showing the boarded up window, I've heard that shit before. First thing is first, fuck this movie. All right, so at the end, I'm talking about that first. I'm making this shit. Then it fucked me up because his face changed, but then it went back to normal. So I didn't know if it got him, got him. Then he jumped out the window. 
I thought she just, I thought that thing and her forced through him. But he threw himself. It legit took me three hours to watch this movie. It's a two hour movie. It took me three hours to watch this movie. I will say, I say this. This movie is not as scary as I thought it was going to be. But it is way more disturbing than I ever want to be disturbed. This shit's uncomfortable. Like, I, I've, been, I've been so uncomfortable and so disturbed by this movie watching it. I about cried three times. Because it's just an uneasy, unsettling feeling, man. This shit's so disturbing. And the little demon bitch killed old dude and then was posed up on the bed like this, like it's about to be on the cover of Vogue or like, you know what I'm saying? Just posed up like like it was sexy and shit. Just this nastiest fucking movie. Yeah, I'll never watch this again. This this will never happen again. I'm about to delete this off my computer a ASAP. This is this is never. I'll never lay eyes on this again. Like, I'll watch the thing again. I'll watch Hereditary again. I'll watch it again. I'll watch The Green Mile and Saving Private Ryan before I watch this. And you know, those are the original movies. I said I'll never watch again because how they made me feel. Like, I, because I cried and stuff. You know what I'm saying? And them heartbreaking movies. This is on the hunt. Like, this is over here by itself. Actually, I don't, I don't want to point it. This is, this can't be, like, this can't go on the shelf nowhere. Like, we got to bury this movie. You know what I'm saying? Like, this shit. Like, we need to lock this away in a box, bury this, set fire to it, and all kinds of different shit. Like, I'll never watch this shit again. It's a fucking disturbing ass movie. And I need y'all to explain to, how me, how, to me how she ran out of steps. Make it make sense to me. Don't say CGI, don't say special effects, because special effects and shit wasn't like that then. She ran out of steps like that. How they do that? She ran out of steps throwing up. I guess I guess it would be throwing down then, because the way her head was tilted, throwing down. Shit was coming out of her mouth. Y'all know what I'm saying. Like, I got shit that's supposed to do today. I don't even want to do shit. I'm so glad October's over. Don't get me wrong. This is a good movie. It's a very good movie. Story-wise, everything. It's a good movie. I'll never watch this shit again. Like, I don't want y'all to think I'm shitting on the movie. I'm not shitting on it. I'll never watch this shit again. The last time I'll see any of this will be when this hit YouTube. We do the live, the, the, the premiere for it. That'll be the last time my eyes ever see this. And I'm be honest with you, if it wasn't chopped up, I wouldn't watch it in. Y'all just have to miss me that from here. Like, I feel like I need to go shower with my clothes on. Like, all this needs to be clean. Like, that little girl's neck gotta hurt. Like, she gotta have neck trouble for the rest of her life. She has to. Her service was loyal. Like, she was paying them really, really good. Because I would not have been there. I'm telling you, I wouldn't have been there. You couldn't have been me. No. She would have called me up like, I know that you went at work today. Bitch, don't call my phone. But yeah, she got that boo, boo, boo. This number has been disconnected. Fuck this movie, man. No, I'm going to get off here. Because I'm, I'm going to go get some ice cream and sit in a church parking lot. And think about life. Well, I hope y'all enjoyed this. Normally, I would say I enjoyed watching it for y'all, but, but I'll be lying. Um, I'm so uncomfortable right now. If y'all didn't do it for me earlier, please do it for me now. Hit that like, subscribe. Don't forget the bell notification. Don't, don't forget to check out the the link in the description to the Patreon. Like, I don't even know what I'm going to eat today now. Because, I mean, I'm just... 
Fuck this movie, man. Halloween is over. And I, for one, is fucking excited. Y'all be good. Y'all be safe. Oh, my God. I'm telling you, when I get out here, I'm letting the biggest air fart. Y'all don't even understand. It's about to sound like a motherfucking foghorn. Night, night.